Let's start by looking at a quick flow of how this automation process works. So basically, you need to start with a YouTube URL. Uh, for me, I mostly use my own videos, but you can use other videos as I will show you soon. This YouTube URL is going to be transcribed by OpenAI's Whisper. ChatGPT 3.5 is going to take that transcription and in this case, we're going to try to write a blog post. But you can see here we are going to use GPT-4 to evaluate that blog post and give it a rating from 0 to 100. And I set this parameter that if the rating falls below 90, we're going to switch model. We're going to use GPT-4 to look at the transcribed text to write a new blog post. We're going to review it again. And if it's above 90, it's going to be saved. And then we have a text we can use for other things too, like social media, audio, etc. And that is basically the workflow. Uh, now I think we are going to go over to Python, look a bit at the code, some prompts and stuff. And then we're going to run it to see how fast we can use this. Let's quickly go over the Python code. So you can see we have our libraries here. We have an open and save file function. Of course, we have our chat GPT function. Uh, we have a function to extract the rating that ChatGPT gives uh, the blog post. We have a function to generate uh, improvement suggestions. We have a function to download a video, convert it to MP3. Uh, here is where we set our URL when we have found the YouTube video we want to use. Uh, we have a code to split the audio into chunks and describe them because they can get a bit big. So we need to divide it into chunks. And basically here is where we start to work with our prompts. So we're going to update job.txt. So in this empty space here, here is where we're going to feed the transcription from the YouTube video so we can start working on it. So you can see you work as an AI journalist at a tech magazine. Your task is to write an excellent, insightful and engaging blog post on a topic from the piece of information. Give your personal thoughts in first person perspective on the topic provided from information. Write the blog post. So that is a simple prompt. You can expand this as much as you want, right? And the other prompt we use are, you're a professional tech writer, editor, and SEO expert. <coughs> Sorry. Evaluate the following job done by your AI journalist. Be critical and score it on a scale from 0 to 100. So here is where the blog post is going to be fed into, right? And yeah, basically at the end, we're going to save the final blog post that is rated over 90. So that is a pretty simple overview of this. If you want to start using this, become a member of the channel. You will find the link in the description below. I will upload this to the GitHub uh, repository for the community and you can download and start using it today. Okay, I think we're going to find a YouTube video and test this out in action. Okay, so let's test this on picking a video from one of my absolute favorite tech channels here on YouTube. So you can see he has a brand new iPhone 15 review. Welcome to the club. So let's copy this link here. Okay, we can go back to our Python code. We find the URL here. Okay, paste it in. So we're going to save that. And yeah, that's about all we have to do. Now let's try to run this and see what kind of results we end up with. Okay, so let's run it. I thought it'd be fun to fire up a timer. So let's just kick that off. Okay, let's go. Okay, so it has finished. Uh, I was away for a while there, so I don't know exactly how long it took. Uh, but you can see here, it gave the new rating uh, a 90 score. So let's take a quick look what happened here from the top here. So it started downloading the video, it trans uh, transcribed it. This is an error I can't get rid of, I don't know why. But anyway, yeah, you can see the initial draft from 3.5 Turbo. We have the initial draft here. Uh, we have a conclusion. And yeah, all the way down here. And here is like a comment. However, it could be improved. Slightly lack of critical analysis, blah, blah, blah. Additional introduction could be more engaging. So this is like the critique, right? And it ended up with like a uh, rating of 85. So it's entering a loop to improve it. Uh, it writes a new draft. Uh, that's a bit strange. Why didn't it rate that? Uh, okay, that's the original draft. Sorry. Uh, okay, so I found deeper look at its sub improvements and innovations. Uh, did it rate that? Yeah, it rated at 88. So that means it had to continue, right? So it uh, drafted again and the original draft and the final draft we ended up on gave it a 90 rating. Perfect. So I uh, I read through this quickly while it was going, and it's pretty good to be honest. It's kind of spot on 
it kind of goes over every new thing with the iPhone 15. So the design, the display, the performance. So what I'm gonna do now, let me just copy this, paste it into like a PDF and let's see how it looks over there. Okay, so here it is. Here we can see kind of the final results. Just add an image, put it into a PDF and yeah, pretty happy with this. Uh, seven minutes around that to create this. Uh, I checked some of the facts here and yeah, looks pretty accurate because it has this grounding in the YouTube transcription, right? Uh, but preferably, this is you want to use this on your own videos. You don't want to be stealing content, right? But uh, uh, at least if you're going to use some of it, try to credit someone with this, right? Uh, but it's perfect for turning your YouTube videos like into some useful content. Uh, so basically, uh, I thought we could take a quick look at the price before we conclude this. So you can see I haven't updated now. We were at 575. Okay, let me update. So we ended up on 667. Uh, and I had to run it once because and there were some errors. Uh, so basically, yeah, let's say just under a dollar for this. So yeah, that is basically it. This is how I use uh, automation to take my videos over to blog posts or other formats. Like I said, if you enjoyed this, check out the membership below if you want to have access to this. Thank you for tuning in, have a great day, and I'll see you again soon.